hello everyone this is Harry from the iris communication today I want to show you how you can flush a custom ROM in an Android phone or in any HTC phone uh, this is HTC Inspire 4G uh, you can do this process in any Android phone in Samsung, in Sony Ericsson, Motorola, anyone okay as you see I have a HTC Sense 3.0 and Android version 2.3.5 okay uh, first what I need to do uh, we have to put the custom room in our SD card and with some additional software as you know there is a one system you can go to the recovery mode by holding the power button and the volume button the volume rocker button but uh, I use instead of that a software is quick boot software I download from the Android market here is recovery if you click this your phone will go to the recovery mode I click this and the phone will start in the recovery mode we'll wait to see as you see this is a recovery mode and for flash a custom ROM we must have the custom ROM in the SD card of the phone so first option is reboot the second option is install from the SD card for changing uh, for make it down the selection you have to click the volume button up and down and go up and down okay and for select you have to you have to press the power button so we will we'll choose this mode is called install from SD card we'll click this and now choose from the zip uh, choose zip from SD card we'll select that option Install from the SD card. Now zip from SD card, and we'll search where we put the custom ROM. But before doing this custom ROM, we have to do, we have to wipe up all the data that we have in the phone. If we not do the two the two ROM, the stock ROM or other custom ROM you have in your device, and the new one with clash with each other and make and your phone will not start as you can see I have here Android Revolution HD 6.1.0 and the other one Lear Doctor OID EX14 full wipe you have to do that the full wipe you have to select the full wipe and select with the power button you have to select that and you have to do that after the installation the wipe you have to come again to the recovery mode and do installation from the SD card and have to find the Android revolution all you need to do click the power button for the installation after doing this the phone will it will take time maybe five minutes ten minutes is depend on your phone and just be patient and it will be all fine it's tested but do carefully every every move you take you have to be careful if you do any mistake your phone will be break okay thank you so much for watching for more information please check www.iriscommunication.com and please subscribe i will make one more video with, with more details and i will install the android revolution 6.3 and i will show you all more details thank you ciao